Welcome back to another edition of Fly Tying for Beginners. Today we're going to tie an olive, acrylic, and soft hackle wet fly. This make will make a great uh, caddis pupa. The hook I have in the vise is a size 14. This is a 2 extra long, 3 extra heavy nymph hook. I'm going to use 70 denier black thread. We're going to start that thread at the eye, and I'm going to put a base of thread down to the bend of the hook where it would hang at the barb. And I'm going to take that back up again. Just want to have a base for the uh, acrylic doesn't slide. Now here is the body material, and this is a little darker than the granny apple caddis color. And it, this is an acrylic hair band, and it's at the store it's called Gimme's. G I M M I E. And you get them from the dollar store. I cut a. Uh, angle on it there. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to catch just the tip of it and then I'm going to pull it and I'm going to secure it to the rear and you can use that holding that at the 45 degree angle in order to keep your thread tight and keep that tight all the way to the back And we're going to bring that thread up forward once again. We're going to stop an eye length to an eye length and a half from the eye of the hook. I'm going to pull the acrylic and start to wrap it. And just like with the granny apple caddis that I made, you want to pull it tight on the end. And when you want it to get larger, you just release a little bit of that tension. And you can do that all the way up to make it larger. It's not real easy to control the tension when you're wrapping it. And we'll bring that right up to the thread. I got a nice taper on there. I'm gonna tie that off. Now when I cut it, I'm going to pull it tight. Put a few wraps in front to trap it. Then I'm gonna pull it tight and trim it close. I'm going to take a partridge feather and I'm going to tie it in by the tip. We can remove that excess from the tip. And you want to keep your thread at about the middle of that head. I'm going to wrap the partridge hackle. I'm going to stroke everything to the rear as I go. And how thick you want to make that how full you want to make that uh, hackle is really up to you. I'd give it at least two or three wraps. I'm going to secure that. Now I can remove what's on the front. Yep, pick that up, wrap it in front of it. And 
Use my poke and snip there, nice and clean. And then we can tie off the head. And here we have an acrylic, olive, and partridge wet fly. Hope that you learned something from this video. Hope you would subscribe to my channel. Please refer me to your friends. Leave comments, questions, suggestions, and most of all, thank you very much for watching my videos.